Magic Masking in DaVinci Resolve. How's it going folks? In this video I will get you started with Magic Masks. It's a really nice and easy way to isolate a subject or a person within a shot so you can color grade differently from your from the background or use it in any way you'd like there's no restraints there before we get into it i would kindly ask you to subscribe and give it a like if it was helpful to you without wasting any more of your time let's get into it so the first thing you want to do with your clip selected you want to go to the color tab after that select on this icon over here it's where it says magic mask obviously and then Make sure that in these options here, you have selected on a person mask instead of object mask. With the picker or with the plus sign, we do a stroke on our subject. Now we can see it did pretty good job on isolating me, but if we zoom in, my hat is not masked really well. So I'm just gonna draw a little stroke over here. You see where it says quality? We can choose faster or better. When I select better, it will refine the selects much, much better. So the next thing you wanna do, as you can see, I only have mask on these blue dots right here. So if I go back to them, you see that the mask is only there. What I have to do is track the mask. It's basically like the tracker and it does a pretty good job. So this is basically the tracking uh, options. You can go to the first frame, you can go one frame backwards, you can track backwards, you can pause, you can track forward and backward, and you can uh, track forward, one frame forward and go to the last frame. What I'm going to do is track forwards and backwards and DaVinci will do its job. It's gonna take a little slower because under quality, I've selected better. Good job. So let me zoom out a little bit. DaVinci did really good job, but we can still refine it a little bit. There's a smart, smart refine function, which is basically still an AI refining. So you can go a little bit further by scrolling or just tapping on it and let's hit 80. And if we go back and forward again, DaVinci does a great job. If I zoom anywhere on it, you can see that it's pretty much perfect. My hair here is not exactly perfect, but for the amount of time that we spent on it, this is awesome. And now you can do your changes only to the selected part. Do whatever you want. You can make yourself bright as the sun if you need. <laughs> <laughs> it's only going to affect what's in this mask. So that was pretty much it guys, really fast, just to get you started with the magic mask tool. I hope it was helpful. I would really appreciate it if you subscribe, give a like, share and everything else. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you, bye, peace, boom, boom.